Hi, this is Joachim for statisticsglobe.com and in this video I will show you how to paste multiple columns of a data frame together in the R programming language. So in the video I'm going to show you an example and this example is based on the data frame that we can create with lines 2 to 5 of the code. So if you run these lines of code you will see that at the top right of RStudio a new data frame object appears. And we can also print this data frame to the RStudio console by running line 6 of the code. And then you can see that at the bottom in the RStudio console, the structure of our data is shown. And as you can see, our data is containing four columns and five rows. So let's assume that we want to paste the three variables x, y, and c together into one combined variable. Then we first need to specify the variables that we want to combine. And this is what we are doing in line eight of the code. And in this line of code, we are saving the column names of our three columns in the data object, my calls. Then in the next part of this example in line 10 of the code, we are defining a new variable that we want to create. So in this case, we are calling the new variable x, y, c. And then we are applying the do call function in combination with the paste function. And within these functions, we are specifying a subset of our data frame, which is consisting of the columns that we want to merge. So if you run line 10 of the code, our data frame will be updated and we can have a look at our updated data by running line 11 of the code. And now you can see that our updated data frame is containing exactly the same columns as before, plus an additional column, which is called XYC. And this variable is consisting of a pasted version of our three variables X, Y, C. So now let's assume that we want to get rid of the original columns that we have just merged. Then we can do that as you can see in line 13 of the code. And in this line of code, I'm using the call names function and the in operator in order to extract the columns that I have merged before. So if you run line 13 of the code, our data will be updated again. And if you run line 14, we can have a look at our updated data. And as you can see, this final data frame is consisting only of two columns, the other column that we haven't touched in the entire example, and the second column, which we have just created, which is called XYC. So in this video, you have learned how to paste multiple columns of a data frame together. However, in case you want to learn more on this topic, you could check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on the homepage I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the R programming code of this video in some more detail. And I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video so you can check it out there. And furthermore, if you have liked the video, I would be very happy if you leave me some positive feedback in the comments. And make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notifications in future when I'm releasing new videos to the channel. That's it for this video. Thanks a lot. See you next time.